Clay County has had its recycle pickup service suspended since August due to a lack of workers. Now, county commissioners are researching ways to bring back recycling while still having enough people to work. News for Jack's reporter Bree Isom joins us live. Bree, what have you learned? Yeah, so this research that they're working on, they're deciding on an option in either April or May. And we've been asking you, the viewers that live in Clay County, what they want. They just want pick up recycling back. Recycling remains an issue for Clay County residents after the service was suspended in August. Residents have to visit certain sites around town to get rid of their recyclables. Clay County commissioners and waste management discussed ways to go around not having enough trash and recycling collectors last week. Since August, uh, WM has hired 13 and lost 16. Uh, we continue to see very low applicant flow of CDL drivers applying in Clay County due to the physical nature of the work. Greg Huntington with Waste Management says one of the reasons for the suspension was to catch up with trash and yard waste collecting. We still to this day remain up to date with garbage and yard waste collection. So there is a silver lining in the decision that the board took. Huntington went over some alternative options with the county officials. One option is using automated side loaders. This would require residents to use certain types of trash bins. We posted on our News for Clay Facebook page asking you at home what you think about that idea and majority of you agreed. Some say it would cost taxpayers too much money. Another option listed would be to alternate pickup for recyclables and yard waste every other week. And another option would be to keep with the drop off locations as waste management continues to hire more collectors. Now coming up on News for Jacks at 11, I talked to a Clay County resident who expresses her concerns about recycling in the county. I'm reporting live in Clay County, Bree Isom, Channel 4, the local station. Thank you, Bree.